So we have our conscious and subconscious mind. And the way we learn things in our childhood, our subconscious learns it. So let's say when we're from zero to eight, nine years old, everything that we experience, we take it for granted. So we take it like it's a whole truth. So we don't have a critical mind to actually justify it or ask a question if that's good for you or bad for you. So that's how we learn things. And many people struggle, let's say, with weight loss or with money issues where they get it to a certain gap and then they cannot reach more. We learn it in our childhood. And let's say that some of your, like one of your parents or both of your parents don't know how to eat healthy. So you learn that experience from them when you were growing up. And eventually your mind, your subconscious mind, it thinks that it's normal to eat that way. That's healthy for you to eat that way. And it keeps continue doing that. And it's really hard to change unless you work with your subconscious mind. So that's what we do in hypnotherapy. We actually work with the subconscious mind and we get into there and we change this pattern. Part of our subconscious is a primitive mind. So primitive mind works very simple way, like animals. So let's say an animal meets another like very like a, let's say a bunny meets a tiger <laughs> so it runs away when it sees the tiger because it's a natural response they don't think that's a tiger that's scary that's why i have to run away they just do it so our mind works the same way sometimes where we are in critical situations our mind works the same way we need to either fight or flight so when we fight we need to do something to resolve the situation. So let's say you meet a tiger, you punch it in the jaw, I don't know, <laughs> in the face. <laughs> and uh, that's how you resolve the situation. So your adrenaline, actually, you use your adrenaline power to resolve the situation. But in our regular life, we have those stressful situations like traffic, or we trying to eat better and we can't, or we look at Instagram and get really frustrated because our the People live their healthy and happy life and apparently they're all perfect and we are not. <laughs> Actually, no one is perfect, but it seems that way. So that's why we got, become stressful and all this stress builds in our body. And the way to work with it is to work with a primitive mind, with subconscious mind and change those settings and change this behavior so you can live a happier, healthier life. And also, as I said, we have a flight response. So basically you see a tiger and you run away. So that's how our subconscious works and actually does it automatically, which is a smart thing to do because probably tiger has very powerful teeth and jaw and runs very quick. So I'm not sure you will be able to, but hopefully <laughs> I really wrote for you. <laughs> Anyway, so in our regular normal situation in our regular world, we tend to, let's say, run away from a relationship. Let's say you have a fight and then you try to kind of stay away from the person and you don't want to resolve the situation. Or oh, let's say um, you get stressed and you start eating. So it's kind of flying away from the situation because you uh, focus on something else. So it's like a stress eating. You know, some people do that. And uh, that's where we need to change this programming. So in those situations, you can actually act healthy and you can find a different coping strategy to resolve this issue. Also, we have a freeze situation where you just freeze in the moment and uh, all your internal feelings also freeze out. And that's also not healthy because freezing and staying passive doesn't resolve the situation. So it's, let's say it's a procrastination where you actually know you have to do something, but you cannot do it. Like you try, you try your best, you force yourself to do it. You put all your willpower and you're like, I just can't do it. I don't know why. It, it seems kind of simple. Other people do it, but for some reason I cannot do it. And also hypnosis work with this as well. So we just work with our subconscious mind and we resolve the situation healthy and happy. And that leads to a healthy and happy life.